theatres and theme parks. Calgary's bleeding art industries has it covered. On this week's Success Stories, we find out how two entrepreneurs built a big reputation for special effects. Bleeding Art Industries was uh, kind of a brainchild um, at the time I was working in, in theater and it was, uh, it, we were kind of suffering through the first set of cuts from uh, Canada Council and uh, so that's where Bleeding Art came from, we were bleeding for our art. And at the time I was looking at movies, I was uh, very interested in theme park work, uh, prosthetics, blowing things up, I, it was a full kind of ball of wax. Leo likes to blow stuff up. Um, and I think what makes him successful with us is as a producer, you know, we want to have solutions. Broken Trail, we shot in 2005. Robert Duvall, Thomas Hayden Church. There was an old 30, 40 year old cabin that we shot in and we had to set it on fire. Cut, put it out, and I was just astonished that there wasn't a stitch of actually this old wood that was burnt. That thus, this being said, Leo looked to us and go, do we want to go again? I don't think it's just about growing a company. Um, anyone that's run a small business or, or knows the statistics behind small business knows that uh, by now, we're in our seventh year, uh, about 85 or 90 percent of small businesses have actually shut down. So I think it's important that companies actually find a way to be sustainable. You know what, you're not your own boss. You've got more bosses when you have your own business. You're dealing with suppliers, employees, the banks, uh, lawyers. What I compare owning a small business to is having a crying child 24 hours a day, seven days a week. If a person that wants to make things happen on your own, you can make it happen. And, and having your own business is the way to try and do that. My advice for success is to, to once you have your dream, to, to follow that and to, to stay with it uh, through thick and thin. Um, still go through with your eyes open and know the business aspect of it, but, but follow that dream and that's, that'll get you there. Coming up after the break, five questions with the youngest Best Actress winner in...